I, Brentech here, where tech is made simple. So at the beginning of August this year, Microsoft made some changes to Windows 11 in the Insider program that were affecting how third-party customization apps may work in the future where trying to optimize and customize Windows 11 to, as an example, look a little bit more like Windows 10 and bring some of the Windows 10 features back like the start menu and the taskbar. Now, as I mentioned uh, in that video, which will be down below, Microsoft had removed legacy parts of the Windows 10 taskbar that were needed by apps like Start All Back and Explorer Patcher to make those necessary changes to the so-called shell or explorer.exe of Windows 11 to roll back some of the features to look more or less like Windows 10 and behave like Windows 10. Now, just to let you know, that in this week's latest Insider Preview build for the Canary Channel, build 26002, um, there is another hidden feature that's uh, been spotted once again by Phantom Ocean 3 over on X that basically stops the operating system from displaying the Windows 10 taskbar. So um, it seems now that um, when you are using third-party apps like Start All Back or Explorer Patcher, uh, it's actually crashing explorer.exe, which is the taskbar, the start menu, your notifications, and so on. So it's crashing the shell and the taskbar when trying to make Windows 10, the taskbar, sorry, when trying to make Windows 11's taskbar look like Windows 10's. Now, as many of you will know, uh, Windows 11 has a lot of legacy components and code that is still available uh, in the actual OS that these third-party apps can use to roll back uh, features to look like Windows 10 as an example. So um, if we just head over to a GIF provided by Phantom Ocean 3 over on X, this will just give you a general idea as more or less what I'm trying to explain. Yeah, you can see that basically um, even if you use a third-party app like Start All Back or Explorer Patcher, um, it will not now make the Windows taskbar appear like it used to. And this is in the, in the latest Windows 11 Canary Channel build 26002 as a hidden feature. Now, what um, Phantom Ocean 3 says over on, on uh, X is that when enabled, it as, the, it as the name suggests, prevents the Windows 10 taskbar from loading. Explorer crashes or just loads the Windows 11 taskbar when trying to load it with Explorer Patcher as an example. So there you can see um, it's just crashing the taskbar and Explorer.exe and you cannot uh, uh, make the Windows 10 taskbar appear. So it seems that uh, Microsoft is quite intent to stop the use of these third-party apps to customize and configure Windows 11. And this is just another indication, although this is a hidden feature, it's still early days. And um, this is just another indication, though, that um, they could be heading in that direction now where they are going to be clamping down on these third party apps. And um, obviously, this is not official, but this code and this GIF provided do show us that obviously you cannot uh, make the Windows 10 taskbar appear. So it seems that this is a direction now that Microsoft may um, be heading in the future where obviously um, third-party apps like Explorer Patcher and Start All Back will not work when trying to customize Windows 11 as an example to um, look like Windows 10. And obviously, I'll keep a close eye on this one. And if more news becomes available or I get wind of any more info, I'll keep you guys posted. So thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.